Being available to the customers is work. It's not all about cooking chems, Claire. It's not all about sampling those chems either. Maybe if you stopped using, you could focus. What? Where's the fun in cooking it if you ain't using it? My mistake. Before you even start, let's skip to the point. We have rooms, one room specifically. Payment due up front. Can you tell me a bit about this hotel? Oh, why do they always have questions? The Hotel Rexford used to be a grand establishment. We even had guests that didn't throw up all over the floor. But now the only people who come by are looking for somewhere to nurse a hangover or shoot up chems. So. Still want a room? Who owns this place? Mr. Morowski. Oh, you should have seen him in his day. This place used to be flowing with high-end chems, beautiful clients, and oh, the parties. But now he just stews in the back office and disgraces his parents' memory. I swear, if they knew how far he's fallen, they'd die all over again. So why don't you rent a room before I get worked up? Tell me more about this Morowski character. Oh, why bother? He's worthless. The other big names caught him with his pants down, and now he just has this ratty hotel. That's the way good neighbor operates. The strong make it to the top until someone stronger kicks them down. Now are you buying this room or not? Tell me a bit about yourself, Claire. I have been working in this hotel for over 40 years, and this is not how I imagined spending my retirement. Now are you done being nosy, or are you getting a room? Let me think it over. Figures. Oh man, someone new! You need some jet, man? Home brewed? Reasonable prices? What's jet? You don't know? It's the best. It just hypercharges everything. Like you got the speed of ten men in one inhaler. What other kinds of chems do you have? Well, you got your medicinal shit. Rad X and Rad Away for radiation sickness. Hey, do you think that's why they call it Rad X? That's far out. Mentats are for the sciencey types, you know, eggheads looking for a boost to solve big problems. Buff outs for the muscle men. Fuck, just try it all, is what I say. You have any work? Yeah, actually, you might be perfect. You know the gunners, right? The high-end mercenaries? Well, a few of them were talking about scavenging around that old hallucinogen building. I mean, just think about that name. There's gotta be some shit there that's out of this world. You get me something, I pay you 200 caps. You said there were gunners out there? The blackest hearted mercs around, friend. Well armed, organized. So, you know, make sure they don't catch you. Your offer's a little low, Fred. Oh, I see where this is going. Job's going to be 200 caps, no haggling. No thanks. Hey. If it was easy, I wouldn't be paying you for it, but okay. Hey. Hey. Hey there. What's the deal? Can I ask you something? What's going down? I wanted to ask you about something else. Okay. What are you thinking about? 
Sometimes the only way to stay sane is to go a little crazy. I think I've got everything I need to know. You got it. Hey. Just point me to it. Hi. Yeah? Anything you want to talk about? What are you thinking about? How do you feel about us? I think you've got what it takes to be a great leader. But you still have to prove yourself. No, never mind. No problem. Yeah? Hey, Rufus. Hey there. Your new round good neighbor, if I'm not mistaken. What do you think of the place? Seems like my kind of place. Bit of a rough town, but beats cowering behind the walls of Diamond City, that's for damn sure. Name's Rufus. I do repairs around here. Keep the robots running, sell a bit of scrap, that sort of thing. I'm usually here or drinking that swill Charlie slinging at the third rail. Looking for parts? I also might have a job for you if you're interested. I'll take a look. Let me know if you want to trade. I just want to trade a few things. We put on some what? Wonderful radio plays. You should listen sometime. Excuse me. Hey. What's on your mind? Just curious what you're thinking. That was it. All right. I really should study my lines. I just clean up around here. Look, I know it's an open door, but it's like a philosophically open door, okay? Get the hell out. What's up, Morowski? You want a room? Claire runs the desk. 
Give her something to do besides breathing down my neck. Now where did I put my script? <clears throat> this place ain't what it used to be. And it ain't used to be much. Thank <laughs> you. 